Hello viewers and welcome back to the Curious Expedition. I have some bad news. The recording of the last two expeditions of the Johan Huizinga run got corrupted uh, somehow, uh, which is made even worse by the fact that it was a pre actually a pretty entertaining run. Um, so I could have just thrown an apology at the beginning of the next run and moved on, but I figure you guys are like 80 episodes deep into this thing and frankly you deserve better than that. So, viewers. Submitted for your approval, let's play The Curious Expedition 84, A Dramatization. We join the expedition a few minutes in as we approach the first shrine. Alright, time to get the best score ever because nothing can go wrong and this game is so easy and I am the greatest. Pfft, I'm not afraid of volcanoes. Anyway, we're going to need some of these moonstones. Oh. Well, this could be worse. Let's just... Oh, damn it. Johan. Johan, you must go on and get a totally wicked score. Just, just really blow it out, man. Like, totally crush it. I shall, Sir Henwood. To honor your... Se seriously, I mean, you have to, like, really kill it, man. No. No, I get it. I'm making like a pretty big sacrifice here. Yeah, I hear if you don't. I'm talking like seven thousand points. Well, okay, I, I'm going to. <coughs> Johan, Johan, come closer. Yes, Sir Henwood, closer. Well, I'm pretty. No, but but, clo but closer though. Yeah, uh, no, but, okay, uh, but I'm as close as. Hey, what? Hey, don't fuck this up. <sighs> okay, oh, we still need. Yeah, right, the dinosaur was like three-quarters of my carrying capacity. Okay, uh, we don't need this, or this, or I guess this, or, uh, yeah. Alright, that'll have to do. Ugh, this sucks, but I need a second moonstone. We'll just run real fast after, uh... Oh! That's, you know, you know what? We're gonna run fast. Everything's fine. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Oh, thank God. All right, well, we made it through that. We didn't get any fame or anything, because I couldn't carry anything out. But maybe we can still pull off a high score on this next expedition. Yeah. Perfect. Needless to say, I was successful, even though Expedition 6 required me to travel the entire breadth and width of the map twice. But as you can see, the fact that we brought home no loot from Expedition 5 means we didn't quite get the high score we were hoping for. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like some comments below. I hope you guys are enjoying the series as a whole. And come back next time for what I believe will be the start of our very last run of the series. And we'll see you then.